Hello everyone, I am the Old Connoisseur, and welcome to my reaction highlights to the 11th episode of the 8th season of My Little Pony, Friendship is Magic, also known as, oh my gosh, I don't remember what the episode title was. Please excuse me as I selfishly go to my own YouTube channel to search for what the episode title is. Um, this is not scripted. I am just absolutely amazing at my job, and I'm not typing it in whatsoever. Uh, this episode, I know for a fact, is something that has been liked by a lot of my friends, so I hope that I like the episode. Molt down. Yes, that is right. I forgot. Okay, please forgive me. Anyway, let's begin. Three, two, one, go. Wait, phoenixes? Wait, you've been meaning to visit Pee-wee? Are you saying you never have in years? Or are you saying you have and we just haven't seen it? Yes, it's your face. No, I'm kidding. Wow, we got to see his scales for a second because they exist. He's not just smooth. Ha, ah, continuity, nice. Also, yay, I love the designs of the phoenixes, so cool. Wow, you forgot about me. Also, cool, nice design. It's going to multiply, isn't it? Obviously, that's how zits work. Let me guess, ten. Ten of them. I'm counting ten. Oh, more than ten. More like fifteen. <laughs> I used to get terrible breakouts anytime I had a final exam with Celestia. Oh, can we please see art of that? You could try Zakora. She makes a cream that works wonders. I've heard. Oh, are we getting Zakora 11 episodes into the season? That's actually impressive. That was actually cool lighting. Also, rest in peace, Twilight's lecture. Wait, use that spell that you used to fix the book in the Crystal Empire. Just use that. Easy. Simple, right? And go somewhere less flammable? The castle is made out of crystal. That's like the least flammable object ever. It's just that I absolutely must have a model for my phoenix feather dress, and no pony else is available. Why would Spike be a good model for a pony dress rarity? Think, woman. Think. Twilight's office is up there. This is a fountain. This is a fountain. Wow. Amazing. I have no idea what you're talking Rest in peace, Spike's outfit. Also, now they're purple too. Cool. I think Spike is slowly getting his rainbow power form. I think that's what's happening. Oh man. I feel so bad for Spike. Rest in peace, my friend. It's all part of growing up dragon. Congrats. <sighs> oh, sorry. What's the problem? What I don't what you're growing up, that's a good thing. It means you matured. No, no, You've no. ascended. Have you been living with ponies your whole life? No. Uh -huh. Because you were an egg at some well, point dragon. with dragons. Apparently I'm not, because the whole point of the molt is that you're growing up. Guard. So you're not young anymore. Yes. <laughs> yes, this is great. I love it. Good job, Pinky. Oh no. Smolder, you don't know what you're doing. Oh, yay, Zakor, never mind. You know, I'm surprised that the animators didn't take the time to draw, like, stink lines or something, like, some green. It's because you have a phoenix feather in your ear, silly. It's a magic element. Oh, okay, never mind then. I swear, if we don't get a Zakora Village episode by season 9 finale, I'm gonna riot. Oh, it's a bird. We're finally seeing a monster in this, like, a creature monster in the season. Cool design. Interesting. Oh, wow, I didn't realize how big it was. I swear to Zakor, if you don't stop rhyming because of this imminent danger, you should really just talk normally. Oh, rip. How did that clause not smash her bones? 
That makes no sense also. Oh no. Spike's turning into the Red Hulk. Or never mind, super speed is a thing, I guess. Oh, that's interesting animation. <laughs> oh my gosh. This is interesting animation. This is actually really good. Oh, get burned. Oh no, spikes. Oh, okay. The Dr. Seuss trees will save him. Oh, cool. We're getting some Twilight laser beam action again. Rarity has magic. Why can't she levitate something? I don't know. Oh no, Spike got... Oh, um, where, where was... Where was freaking... Oh no, Spike's dead! He's dead! Oh no! Whoa, amazing. Oh my god. I would act surprised, but I did see some leaks. I'll fake a surprise for you. Oh my god! Spike has wings! Am I Larson? Oh wait, he's not to blame because he wasn't here anymore. But, oh my god! Someone gave Spike wings! Every character gets wings. You get wings. You get wings. Everybody gets wings. Spike gets wings. Derpy gets wings. Fernando get the straw gets, gets wings. Maud gets wings. We all get wings. You grow your wings. Red Bull gives you wings. The, the conclusion is Spike drank Red Bull. And somehow Spike knows how to fly super easily despite Twilight having to struggle when she got her wings. <laughs> Dude, there's a lot of, like, rest in peace jokes that I could do with this one. <laughs> Spike is in control of his firepower, literally. We are new, and I don't want to overdo it. Haha. Uh... -ha. Twilight, you are still the big sister. I can't believe or mother, or whatever you'd like to call it. Great. Basically, Rarity is just abusing Spike again. Okay. I'm satisfied. I'm satisfied because... As much as people wished that Magical Mystery Cure should have been a two-parter, Spike is, despite being one of the main characters, enough of a of a character that uh, one episode where he gets wings is appropriate, and I think that they paced it pretty well. I mean, I'm gonna say that because they took their sweet time with Spike being turned to stone, so, you know, they obviously didn't have a problem with pacing. Anyway, um, I'll share my thoughts in my review with you. Thank you. Please share your thoughts and, uh, well, your reactions to, uh, my reactions to the episode. And, uh, I guess that's about it. So, once again, I'm the Elm Connoisseur. I thank you for your time, and I'll see you in the review.